Hey, it's Ethan here at eTrailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Piston Pro bike rack on the back of our 2023 Cadillac XT4. It is a premium bike rack. It's capable of supporting two bikes held primarily by the dual wheel mounts, up to 67 pounds each. So it can work with plenty of different bike types up to and including your e-bikes. It's nice that there's no frame contact being made. So in the event that you wanted to transport some carbon frame bikes, you could do that as well and the actual wheel hoops themselves do adjust to accommodate different tire sizes. So any alternative frames or kid style bikes, or anything like that would work as well. This rack also offers the ability to tilt away with the bikes loaded. So if you pull this lever here at the front, you could tilt the whole bike rack down. I will say, because I don't want to hold the bike while I'm doing it, it makes it a little bit difficult to actually ease the rack down. And if you have a bike loaded up, on the bottom, I could see that being a little bit difficult as well. That being said, once it's tilted, it gives us plenty of room to open the hatch and even more room back here to sit down, change our shoes if we needed to, or get into the back and get any items we might need for our ride. To get the bikes unloaded is straightforward. Just holding onto the bike itself, push these releases down at the bottom, which will give you enough room to get your bike up and out. As we fold these down, you can hear the ratcheting system that is in place, so it'll secure your tires pretty much anywhere it's going to stop, and you just release again using that button. As you can see, these struts here have a Kashima coating, so they're always going to be lubricated, and no matter how dirty or muddy they might get, they'll always slide in and out easily. Additionally, the trays accommodate a wheelbase built in of up to 53 inches and a tire size of five inches. So you can get fat bikes on here as well. And the system allows you to transport two bikes without them making contact with one another because they can slide up and down the trays as they need to. With it in this position with the bike unloaded, it still does take a little bit of space from the back of your vehicle. So let's just create a measurement right now to see how much distance we're going to be adding from the bumper to the furthest point back. Coming in at about 25 and 3 quarters inches, so not as bad in this position as some of the other bike racks that we've tested. From ground clearance, from the ground to the bottom of our tallest tray, it's going to be about 24 and a quarter inches. So there is a nice little rise in the shank, and ground clearance isn't something that I would be worried about on this vehicle. But another feature that this rack does offer is the ability to fold up. I will say in this position, it does get pretty close to the back of our car here. The closest point, probably being too close for me to even measure, a little under an inch, I would guess. But I will say that the anti-rattle device does do a great job of keeping things secure. So I wouldn't be worried about it making contact with my car. That being said, from this position, folded up, it's going to only be sticking out about 11 inches. So it does shorten things from the back of your vehicle quite a bit. It is a two inch shank that fits into our two by two inch receiver tube, held in place by this pin and a lock that's key to like to where you can put a cable lock on the rack itself. It all secures in place with this tool that's actually included on the rack itself. You just put it in and tighten it up. So the installation is really straightforward. It's not exactly tool free, but you don't have to include the tool wherever you go because it does store on the rack. Overall, the Kuat Piston is a premium option that's going to get the job done. It's going to look really nice while it's doing it. It does include these lights on the back that you can set up if your vehicle has four pole wiring. We don't hear, but it is an option if it works for you. I would say if you don't need all the bells and whistles or the aesthetics, maybe check out the Rocky Mounts Guide Rail. It's going to get the job done in a similar way. But like I said, the Kuat Piston is a really nice looking rack and it fits really well in the back of our 2023 Cadillac XT4. We're going to take it out here on the test course. First thing we're going to do is hit the bumps. We're just going to see what it's like if we did hit some speed bumps. I'm watching the bike, watching how it holds on the tires. It looks like it moves just a little bit, not too much. This is mostly standard with other bike racks, so nothing to worry about. The bike doesn't look like it's going anywhere. Now we're going to go a little bit faster in the parking lot. I'm going to take some aggressive turns and see how it handles there. Looks like it's fine. I see a little movement again, but again, the bike's not going anywhere, so I don't have to worry about it. 